Hi and welcome to NET Vapor Reviews. Today's review is a excellent starter kit. Why am I doing a review on a starter kit? I'll tell you why. Because a lot of vapors now, with all this commotion that's going on in America about the flavor ban, here in England, people, it became a major topic of conversation vaping. And the difference between the UK and the US has become so evident that vaping in the UK has become uh, on the forefront of a lot of conversations. And a lot of smokers are now, instead of shying away from vaping, they're looking into vaping because they can see the difference between UK and America, how the, the attitude towards vaping is. And the UK is so much pro vaping so they're starting to ask themselves maybe we should start looking into it so I became quite busy <laughs> in the last um, two weeks and I suggested so far I think it was around five smokers to try this Inakin Adept Slide so one of one of the people I tried to convince, <clears throat> sorry, I'm recovering from a cold, so my, my horse is a bit, my voice is a bit hoarse. Um, so he, <clears throat> I ordered for him this uh, this kit. So I said to him, would you mind very much if I review it, and for the benefit of others, he says by all means, and he gave me the e-liquid he chose as well to review. But I'll do in a minute. So, this tank, this setup, I used to, for instance, suggest to people in the can T20S, the T18, even the, the OBS Cube Mini, that I use this quite often, very often, in fact. It's a very, very good kit, this one. But he wanted um, more battery power um, and a more rugged... He works in construction, so I ordered him this one because this is... I'll come to that in a minute. We'll come in a minute to the details. But anyway, the vape quality on this is absolutely superb. That we'll start with. Superb. And um, the coil that I'm using now is a 0 0.48 Plex 3D coil. They're excellent flavor. I know from other people it lasted up to two weeks. And some even longer. So... We'll wait and see. But let's go through a bit the, the spec here. First of all, the tank is very good looking. You get them in various colors. Um, this is a conservative color, black, all black. I think it's quite attractive looking. It's more of a man's mod uh, kit. A woman, you know, you got all sorts of different colors, ocean, uh, all sorts of different colors, sky. But this is uh, the guy I ordered from suits him very much. And in fact, I would have ordered the same color, I think. Can't go wrong. And even the, the aluminum, the top and bottom, that is solid, is the same color. So it looks quite nice. Now, so the tank is a very simple tank. Uh, it's very similar to the Zenith. I've got here the Zenith, I used quite often. Um, this is the Zenith, obviously the one with the liquid, the blue one, is the slide. The difference in size is not mm, noticeable, but this is a bit smaller and taller. But the Zenith, you put the juice in here, and this is a opener, so you, but this is the thing, this is a child protection here. So this mouthpiece is preventing it from opening but if you lift it just a little bit you just have to lift it just okay we're not all of it but you lift it a little bit and then you open it and you're putting your juice from here this could be annoying to some people and some people will enjoy it that kids can't mess around with it but I never came across kids opening a tank so what you can do is they gave you another drip tip in the kit just put in a different drip tip. This drip tip has got like a little nudge, like a little sticking out piece. 
and that stops from the tank to open. So you just either take it out or lift it a bit. Also, you could open these two screws and take this off fully and dismantle this whole tank because you do get a spare glass. Now this is quite well protected already because you got a steel cage. But say you broke it, you, you give you a spare glass, undo it, put in a new glass, it just pops out and that's it. To change a coil, very easy, you just open up the bottom here, bottom ring, pull out the coil, put a new one in, and you close it. That's the beauty of this tank. It's the same simplicity of in Anakin's of late, like the Zenith, and the coils of the Zenith go in here as well. So if you have a Zenith and you want to upgrade to this, you can use the same coils. Um, I keep it on number two opening to get a nice mouth to lung, but if you want, you could, um, let's mount it on the, de on the, on the mod, um, you could open it fully and you can get a direct to lung. A bit restricted, but it's not meant for it. It's meant for a mouth purely mouse to lung and if you keep it a number two this is absolutely superb now the mod itself is five clicks on five clicks off now over here if I press this you will see if I press the fire button uh, oh, it's off Okay, you will see an arrow pointing right. Now, if you look in the bottom here, you will see the list of, if it's pointing right, so it's below one ohm. So then you have an option of wattage. Uh, oh, reading. <laughs> 14, 15, 16, 17. So obviously mine is on the right now because it's 0 0.48 a coil. Now to change the wattage, you just simply, this is the lowest going to the highest. And so now it's on 17 watts and it's perfect. The flavor is full flavor. I'll come to the flavor in a minute. Now they give you also 1.6 coil. So then the arrow will be on the left so then you got the maximum power of 11 to 14 watts so this is a very nice touch that you've got over here the list of wattage and now i haven't tried this but i've got here the kfon prime rta now this i vape on 16 watts and this is a a, um, a one on coil it's interesting to see if I can use it on this mod so let's I'm gonna undo this and let's see if, if it come if it registers because this mod is meant to recognize the coil so let's see what happens oh yeah see it will show me it shows me it's above one ohm I think, yep, one ohm. So it's, and let's see if we'll wave it now. Mm. Perfect. So one could use this mod for any tank, mouse to lung. Obviously, direct to lung won't work on 60, because you got here maximum 17 watts. I normally vape on 16 on on this device. Um, this is the Wismec with an 18650 battery. Now this is another thing. This mod is a 3000 ma battery. So this will last you quite a long time on a 17 watts. I think it looks quite nice. Huh? What do you think? 
Kfon on the Anakin. Anyway, this review is on the Anakin, not on the Kfon. Let's put back the Kfon where it belongs. And uh, we'll put back the slide. Yeah, so this, so let's see the, I mean, this is an IP67. Apparently dustproof, shockproof, waterproof. Um, so if you drop this in, in a pool or somewhere, it should last. I couldn't find anything that's nagging here, except for one little thing, that to open up the USB, I don't have nails, so it is very difficult. So what I did is I used a paper clip, paper clipper, and I just open it this way. Yeah, and here you've got your USB. And apparently it's a fast charge. Um, the problem I find with these that it's about to tear. I mean, eventually. But if you're not planning to drop this in water or, or going with it on an on, on a Amazon jungle expedition, uh, nothing will happen if this fell off. Um, or this USB is exposed and there's no problem. So worst comes to worst, this will be exposed. But if you're careful, it shouldn't shouldn't tear. The clicking is very comfortable, and it's fast. Um, over here, you choose your wattage. I think I said before, yeah. And what else is there to tell you? Nothing much. You see, that's why this is a beauty for a starter kit because it's so simple. And it's very good looking, um, very light, doesn't weigh at all. I think this weighs even more than this. Um, yeah, it's a nice setup. The e liquid I'm trying here is, I don't think it's worth a review, but if I'm already talking about it, it's called Vampire Vape. Heisenberg. Now, what I call this e-liquid is a palate cleanser. If you vape tobacco or strong flavors or something and you need something to cleanse your mouth, to try another flavor, this is perfect. Perfect. It's a fruity, minty, very similar to the Dr. H I reviewed not long ago from Reggae Juice, but a bit more strong on the mint. Um, I don't think you can drip, put this in a dripper. I think it's going to be too powerful, the mint. But on a mouse to lung tank, it is a very nice flavor. can't vape this long because it's 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 a too I'm, I'm now recovering from a cold so this is perfect <laughs> it's like a minty minty um, fruity Heisenberg okay Heisenberg it's very similar to Dr. H as I said but it's a very refreshing one especially when you go a bit of a cold yeah or palate cleansing it really refreshes your taste buds Indeed. The only thing is that I think this type of liquid would leave a lingering taste in the coil. So if you ever want to change a flavor, it's going to take you a while till the coil will change to the flavor, you, the new flavor you're putting in. Because this is quite a strong flavor. And also I think the tank, you'll need to wash it very well to get rid of this um, minty, fruity flavor. And that's why I think the only thing with this flavor. I haven't tried it. It's the first time I'm vaping this um, liquid. Um, yeah. Anyway, so going back to this kit, um, it's got like a rubbery silicon type of covering, very com comfortable to the hand. Um, yeah, it's very nice. It's rugged, it feels solid. Um, you can drop it and 
if you want to drop it, I don't see why you want to drop it, but if you do drop it by mistake, nothing should happen except if the tank glass breaks. But to drop the mod on its own is no problem. Maybe you'll break this bit, I'm not sure, <laughs> I wouldn't try it. But it's meant to be uh, built strong for real life. Rated IP67, dustproof, waterproof and shockproof. <coughs> yeah. Um, you got them in various colors and um, what else can I tell you? It's got all the um, protection, it's got over discharge protection, overcharge, over voltage, short circuit protection, overheat protection, high resistance protection and cutoff protection. Um, and it got six durable colors. You've got purple, black, white, ocean sky and forest camel. Yeah. Um, it's not much more I can say and that is why this is good for a starter because just open, put in your liquid and vape away and choose your wattage by pressing this button up and down and that's it the flavor you're getting here is superb I'll, I'll do it fully open Let's try it fully open. Airy mouse to long, fully open, and a restricted mouse direct to long. Very restricted, but possible. If you want to have on occasion a bit more vapor. But initially, this is a pure mouse to long tank. Um, very similar to the Zenith, but I think it's it's better in the mechanism of filling. The 0 0.48 uh, Flex 3D is um, very good coil, very good flavor. Um, I ordered them also a coil, and this is what the coils are. Z Plex 3D coil. 0 0.48 ohm 13 to 16 watts mesh 3d mesh inside uh, and they're very reasonably priced um, 30 something pounds for a starter kit can't go wrong yeah I think I covered it so if anyone is interested for an starter kit, I fully recommend the Inneken Adept Slide. I didn't open all the cases are the same. You got in there USB warranty instructions, spare glass, spare coil. You see one box, you see them all. But Inneken is the normal, the normal fare. Yeah, see them all. It's only a box. Okay, I think uh, I covered this. Um, the Indican Adept Slide Tank. Perfect starter kit. Right, um, this is the end of the review for this one. And I hope that the situation in regards to the flavor ban will be a bad dream. And the truth of the health benefits of vaping will prevail. With that, I'll conclude this review. Take care, enjoy your vape. Until the next review, take care, bye-bye.